Former Coronation Street star Will Meller has confirmed he and Strictly Come Dancing partner Nancy Shu have seen their week 4 preparations thrown out of the window. Will appeared on BBC Two's It Takes Two with a rather croaky voice and itchy cough to reveal he's been bed-bound all week after contracting a virus, meaning training has had to take a back seat. It Takes Two host Jeanette Manrara raised the issue of Will's health woes moments into their interview on Thursday's show. She said, We just need to start by saying you've not been feeling very well this week. How are you feeling now? Jeanette asked, prompting Will to update her, No, no. Erm, I don't sound very good. I've been in bed, I got a bug, or, a virus so I've not drained all week. Kate Garraway leaves NTA's fans in tears with gesture to Kelsey Parker after award win Kate Garraway planted a hug on Tom Parker's widow Kelsey during this year's NTA's after the pair were nominated for the Author Documentary Award. As Kate took to the stage, the emotions became clear as she thanked viewers and ITV before updating viewers on Derek's current state. So yeah, we're just hoping Dr. Theater kicks in and in time for Saturday, he added. Showing her own support, Jeanette weighed back in, we're crossing our fingers, we're all crossing our fingers. This week, Will and Nancy are set to perform a rumba to Ed Sheehan and Taylor Swift's The Joker and the Queen. It's beautiful, Will said of the song choice but later in the interview, Jeanette was keen to hear how Nancy felt given the lack of training the pair have undertaken. But Nancy, the rumba is such a tough dance and we know it's one of the hardest ones to do on the show, Jeanette said. You've not had much training this week already because Will's not been feeling well. So how has it been going with the little bit you've been able to do? Nancy candidly admitted, I don't want to lie, but there is a little bit of worry inside of me. You're worried? I'm terrified, Will interrupted as laughter rippled through the studio. Desperate to recover, Will added, I'm just praying that I wake up tomorrow morning and I feel better. Because I really want to dance this, it's a beautiful song with this beautiful routine and I really wanna do it justice. But I can't help it if I'm, ill, the former soap star added. Will and Nancy have so far managed to avoid the dreaded dance-off so far this series, but could a lack of training land them towards the foot of the table? Last week, it was Richie Anderson who said his goodbyes after losing out to Fleur East. He followed in the footsteps of Kay Adams who was the first celebrity to bow out of this year's contest. Directly Come Dancing continues Saturday at 6.30pm on BBC One.